Okay, mommy, I can put my belongings in the taxi by myself. Oh, no, no, no. Let me help you, honey. Did you make sure you had everything you needed? Yes, mom. I have got my passport, my mobile phone, and my money. I put all of them in this saddle bag. How about you, Sophie? Did you pack your luggage? Yes, of course I did. Helen helped me to double check this morning. Good. Hey, Helen. I talked to your cousin Sarah last night. She will pick you up at the airport, and Sophie's parents will pick her up. Thank you for letting me stay with you the whole summer. I did have the most wonderful time ever. I will be back next summer. You are welcome, Sophie. We were happy to have you in the house too. I hope you can stay for longer next time. Sure, I will discuss that with my parents. Okay, come on, get in the car. We need to move now, or we'll be late for the flight. Goodbye, mommy. Bye. Have a safe flight. Call me when you arrive at Sarah Place, okay? Yes, mom. Please take care of yourself. Love you. I love you more. Where can I take you? To the airport, please. Can you drop us off near the terminal B? Yes, sure. Did you forget anything in the taxi, Sophie? No, I took up everything already. Okay, let's head off to the check-in counter to check in our bags and get the boarding passes. What a long queue of passengers here. How long do we need to wait for our turn? Not so long, Sophie. Be patient. Everyone looks so fancy. They are wearing beautiful clothes and have nice suitcase. Look at the girls over there, Helen. She has got a big teddy bear with her. Do you want one like that, but in a smaller size? Yes, yes, I want it. I will buy you one when we get into the departure lounge. There's so many souvenirs like that there. Yay! Thank you, Helen. You are my best aunt ever. Okay, Sophie, move off. It only takes three more passengers before it's at our turn. See, I told you we don't have to wait long. You are right. I am just so excited to get on the plane. Good morning. We would like to check in. Hello. Please show me your tickets and passports. Yes, here they are. One is mine and one belongs to my niece. Are you Miss Helen's green? Yes, I am. Why are you flying to Arizona, miss? I am an overseas student. I earned a full scholarship to study in the U.S. for four years. I have an admission notice from Arizona State University. Here it is. Where would you stay in the U.S.? I will stay with my cousin Sarah. She has an apartment. Okay, I see. How about this little girl? Is she your child? No, she's not. She's my niece. Her parents and she had a summer vacation with us, but they had to get back to America earlier for some urgent business. She had been staying with us for the last two months. Her mom asked me to take her with me. All right. Sorry for the many questions. I hope you don't mind. Is it a compulsory step for flying abroad? No problem. I totally understand. Thank you so much. How many bags are you checking in? Three bags, please. Sure. Please put them on the scale. All right. Twelve point five kilogram. Please be aware that any kind of electronic device and alcoholic beverage are prohibited in the cabin beverage. Yes, definitely. Thank you for your patience. These are your boarding passes and passports. You will be boarding at gate F1 at 1 o'clock. Enjoy your flight. Thanks. Goodbye. Bye, miss. Sophie, follow me. We are going through the security now. Look and do exactly what I do. Okay, Helen. 
My parents have taught me what to do here several times. Put your bag in the tray, Sophie. Take off your shoes, your jackets, and empty your pockets as well. Yes, I am done. Good. Let's step through the scanner. I will go first. You will go after me. What is that sound? Don't worry, girl. You forgot to unlock your watch. Is it made of metal? That is why the machine alerted. Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. You can go through now. Put on your clothes and make sure you don't forget anything here, Sophie. Let's take the escalator to our gate. Hmm. Let me see. F one. Hmm. This way. We need to wait here for the boarding announcement. In the meantime, do you want to go around and find something to buy? Yes. You promised to buy me a small size teddy bear to bring on the plane. On the right, Sophie. At the souvenir store, they have many different types of toys. Wow. Amazing! I love that blue bear on the top left corner of the shelf. What about this one? The yellow one under it. Do you like it? Hmm, it is so lovable. I love it too. What should I pick? It is up to you. Just think for a second and decide later. Hmm, I chose the blue teddy bear. I prefer it more. Good choice. Here you are. I already paid. Thank you so much, Helen. I will keep it forever. <laughs> are you sure about that? Undoubtedly, Sophie. Can I buy you something? I have ten dollars. My mom gave it to me at the beginning of the vacation. I did not use a cent of it. No, it's okay, Sophie. I do not want anything. You can save it for getting to college when you grow up. Thank you for choosing Allegiant Air and Spirit Airlines. Hey, I just heard the announcement. Let's go. Okay, we are passing through a tunnel now. Yes, I know the boarding bridge. The plane is on the other side of it. Do not run, Sophie. Hold down. You do not want to fall off before the flight, right? Good afternoon, ladies. Welcome to the plane. Thank you for choosing Allegiant Air and Spirit Airlines. I hope you will have a good flight with us today. Wow. I am so lucky to have a window seat. I can see the sky through this small window. Yes. How long will we be in Arizona? I already miss my parents. About ten hours. Wow, a long trip. But I am very happy to be here with you. Yes, and I am so delighted to see America in real life. <laughs> 